morning collective we're gonna do a quick energy check see what your ancestors the universe the divine want you guys to know as you're navigating through your journey ascending to your highest good everybody called in the appropriate protection this is a time to sweeting so it's whenever it finds you Somebody's on their journey for happiness, for the for abundance, happiness, blossoming. Somebody's blossoming. Wow! I didn't even peep this. One, two, three. Okay. been a revelation healer of ages victory and success somebody discovers something about themselves Somebody discover something about their self. Somebody's, somebody wants happiness. They're on their journey. Somebody's happiness is leading them on the journey to their abundance, their blossoming. There's been a victory and success here. Guys, I wake up every day and I'm like really thankful all the time for the breath that I'm taking for having my eyes to see. I'm so grateful for the life that God has given me. I love everything about my life, my past. Somebody's on their leap of faith. made me the person I am today and I'll never stop growing a lot of you guys are never going to stop growing either every day is a learning lesson you're never too old to learn something one thing I've always I've always told people ten of pentacles their abundance somebody who was wounded the wounded warrior possibly hurt got some kind of communication and they're on their journey there's been a victim and success I always tell people since I was a little girl stay humble stay humble because just like as quickly as you get it God takes it away somebody's on their their jerk their Somebody's gonna find out they're pregnant. God is a miracle. God does so much many miracles. Yeah. This King of Cups is on their journey to you. 
evolve because of love and they're creating boundaries. Guarding their heart, their emotions, is now protecting their heart. They're being guided. They're not allowing nobody to fuck this 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 journey up. By the book. By the book. They're cleaning it up. They want things done by the book. This person was wounded. Whatever this wound was, whatever they went through, this heartbreak, this loss, this whatever this was for them, it put them in that energy of wanting better. Wanting better. I keep hearing wanting better. They want to heal. They want a victory and success. Blossoming in abundance. That's the Ten of Pentacles. They want to heal. They actually want it now. the life. This person was stuck in the past. They're on their journey. They're taking that leap of faith on their journey. a Scorpio they feel like you're so beautiful yeah they're doing the shadow work they're allowing their emotions they're following their gut instincts There's a victory here. Two victory cards. What did I say? This person was wounded. They're doing the shadow work. Possibly a Scorpio. We just see the King of Cups. This person was stuck in the past, limiting themselves by old beliefs I keep hearing. Old beliefs. They had to break down, strip their old beliefs. The old way of thinking. Well, this is how my mom did it. This is what my father did. This is what I see my uncle go through. This is, yeah. They got their heart broken. Only way to get the truth is to reach out. Spirit is telling this person to reach out.
this King of Cups is a could possibly have Aries, could possibly have Pisces, maybe a Pisces or Aries. Somebody, somebody did something here. Take it where it resonates, guys. You guys could be dealing with an Aries, a Pisces, a Scorpio. was stuck in the past. Why? Remember to smile every day, guys. Remember to smile. Why was this person stuck in the past, ancestors? Show us the cards we need to see. Why were they stuck in the past? going to be victory and success nothing that it was a bad investment they went back to somebody from the past they went back to they had a decision between two this was something meant to maybe they were with a, a, a Pisces a Cancer a Scorpio we do have a matching pair here but that doesn't mean that that's a divine pair that's just the, the body that they're embodying that person did this to them. Whoever this Queen of Cups is, whoever they collaborated with, was not a Queen of Cups. Nothing flourished. This is an angry person who was after them for their money, their stability. That person did this to them. Now they're protecting their heart. Or maybe this is something that they went through before meeting you and they put up those barriers because of what they went through in the past. Stuck in the past. Who are they coming towards? Coming towards ancestors of the highest way, like show us the cards we need to see, please, and thank you. going to somebody who gives them strength who makes them want to do better with their life the one that they didn't choose show them something. Spirit showed them something. Possibly about manipulation, lies, deceit that was going on. 
all beliefs like to so we said that's the truth Guided by their grandmother. They have a, a relative, a loved one in heaven guiding them. And this person is not backing down the spirit. It's making sure that this 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 King of Cups person gets to where they need to go. Somebody's gonna have a baby. This person had to let go of the control issues. They possibly went back to somebody they had kids with also that was holding them back because of the kids. This kid looks terrified of the dad. This mother, this queen of cups, a lot of manipulation meant to They got, oh, and they bring no beginnings. This person is purifying the energy. What is the potential outcome of this? Chop wood this baby mother up. Not literally. You know what I mean. They gotta clear their energy, balance themselves, so that they can get to Treasure Island and go towards that Empress, the Yin, the person who holds their heart. Forty-four. time coming. Somebody they're highly attracted to, they want to come in. They're following their gut instincts now. They're on their journey. The leap of faith, the fool came out. They want to apologize. You're their complete happiness. This person's hoping for victory and success with you. They want to do things by the book. They're watching you do things by the book. They see your growth, yeah? This could possibly be a Scorpio who's turning their back on whatever this baby mother type of shit was. They got real with themselves. And they're hoping for victory and success. This could be your twin. Get 
gifts. Yeah. They're coming in with this commitment, this offer. different ways to enhance your home guarding and surroundings that's exactly what this person is doing they sat there they realized what they were given energy to the people the places the things the emotions the mental the old way of thinking my mom did it like this so i have to do it like this my dad did it like this so i have to do it like this i see my grandmother do it like this grandma's like no it was the wrong way that this person's grandmother is like here. This person's grandmother is here. Angel number zero 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 is a reminder that you are one with God and you feel your creator's presence. Baby, you be freaking me out sometimes. Seven Eleven is usually a sign of new beginnings. People who resonate with Seven Eleven are very open and kind. This person was a kind, open-hearted person. That Queen of Cups was showed up as that, but that's not the energy she was in. She was in this energy. Love and light. 